How's it going, guys? Chris back here again with some more Mr. Brawl. Today, you can visit Reborn. Uh, this is a pretty much fully multicolored deck, and I should not have kept this. Um, that's a bad start. Bronte Potato is our opponent. We're up against a Narsile the Exiled. Narset the Exiled. Enlightened Exiled. My god, I can't. Um, she's too powerful, man. I don't know. Especially if I get mana screwed, more than likely. You keep it to land hand. Yep, here it comes. Um. There are good ideals here, man, but uh, getting to them. Multicolor, I had to do it. Not a good mana rock, but I had to do it. It could be okay. That's uh, that's one nail in the coffin. One nail in the coffin. One is ramping. Ramping well. Oh, there we go. Uh, what do we need? Black. White. So, drop the crown. Probably. All of these double green stuff that we have to get to. One are black, we have to force those. This is covered, not covered, not covered, covered, covered. Um, down our point. Any Mopako, she is our boy. She's got to do the job because three hard up. The Quintor has actually got to become a Planeswalker. I cannot believe it. Our first Elephant Man Planeswalker. The Loxagon of this species doesn't a lot of other fiction. So, we got, we got, our, we got our boy. There's always a good one, too, but like, four Quintorius and the Lore Masters of, uh, with their guild called. Lorehold? Yeah, before the Lorehold boy showed up, uh, Red White was kind of sad. And very cool. Can't do anything about it, opponent. Uh, I will take it into the base. Not double, but it's one of the only things I can do. Uh, let's just check out, man. I'm nearing that point because we got mana screwed, and uh, our opponent has. Got their game plan online, and we are no. I think we're done. Okay. Rough start for old Nifmith. I will pay more attention to my hands. I will make sure that you don't get mad if that you show off that you have lots of colors. And you can draw the colors when I eat. Nip is it, he was kind of the Atraxa. Or Atraxa was a thing. And then Atraxa showed up and just did what he did, but slightly better. And, uh, okay. Too many red sources, but. Uh, I think I can take this. Next turn, I go get a blue source. Now I go get a horse. And, uh,. We Uro into more lands. Green source is what I want. Green's tower is blue. Blue, white, and black. Yep. 
I'll take the Sephir's headquarters. That is... That is a step in the right direction. So we have green, red, black, or white. We need another, another black or white sword. Actually get our, uh... Get our commander down. That is it. This could be bad. We could just... Fighting broker. Fighting broker like Uro back. I was gonna get the uh, the fable passage, but Uro's probably stronger. Yeah, the attack gets first strike is. Uh, Pretty rough. Double block the envoy if we have to. We're trying to set up a situation where casualty of war is uh and right on threat. We need to move quickly. I doubt that that's gonna be possible now, but I only have two cards, so we could face one thing and get buried revival. Uh, rough. Tempt it. Tempt it. Um, uh, then we have the Vala if the worst case happens. When you then get me a card in Obala. and then we can vivid necessary back. All right, that is that probably. In the turn, maybe in a mono, maybe mono colored is possible. Iron crag and file. Can 
you're gonna need to turn this around upon it. I think these guys have it under control. Universe can find me something. Okay. Gonna end the turn there though. We're in a resource war at the moment and I am not gonna not gonna throw things into it that don't want to be thrown into it. Alright, we'll go on to game. Game 3 at 11 minutes. That is kind of slow. Okay. Yeah. Generally, we're at the 13 to 15 range. And if we push 15 minutes, I'm always hesitant to continue. But, uh. I don't know, I think, I think I'll, uh. Hit me pretty well. Other than the game I meant, other than that game, we did okay. The multicolored cards are... They don't not to find their way into decks. Because... Just the metric cut of them. And... You have things like Putrefy. That... Were really good, back in the day. Did they go with the tap line at first? They're just two mana black cells that destroy a creature, right? And it's um that's the ninety percent use of Putrefy. And it is a versatile removal spell. They're green source. Helion. Hold up, Putrefy. It's an instant. Yeah. Alright, I'll call those cards. There are a lot of them. And then you, uh, you end up in a situation where you also just have white cards. Or, not white cards, monocolored cards. Do the same job. potential. Then we get down Lotus. Go from there. Are we just... Are we at a point where one of the lands may... We could be... Our... This has to be our... This has to be our black source. We're not at the point. Not at that point. Uh, that certainly will be. Golden Lotus can be red. Oh, I'm just dead. Eat, eat. Oh, goodness. I don't even see this one. Our opponent will get the job done in a half hour. Buff and he's uh bra. No, it felt it felt like we might probably would have been if we hadn't created so much. We didn't play Gandalf and Gandalf. Not gonna not gonna absorb enough health to get around that. 
I mean, Basby kept coming down and making the attackers uh, slightly stronger. Probably. And nail in the coffin. I think that wasn't really Basri, it was, it was the, the setup was two thirds of the way there, right? You have the creature that, another creature in the battlefield you gain life, you have the Heliod that gives counters whenever you gain life, and it's also not turned on, so when the Basri came in it turned it back on. There were a lot of different factors in there that uh, helped that happen. For you all again, this two land hands are not acceptable. Is well, depending on how fast our general control opponent is, probably too fast, honestly. Axiot on one, the human. Yep, there we go. Uh, creeper, you get a creeper on two. Kind of looks like a creeper. Vaguely, got the the four little nubs down at the bottom that it used to move around, and it's long and green. Kind of creepy. Now, Minecraft, one of those games that I wasn't. What? Oh, that's on me. Yeah, it was one of the games that I was not into for a very long time, and then eventually I came around to it. It was a Brute or Pakal, and they're the same. Same toughness? Pakal oh, adds a little bit more damage. Should we go right? This is where we're going. Black mana is not encouraging. Our opponent is Goose Boy. X Dimension 9999. Nine, nine. Goose? Doesn't even do anything. Ah. This way we get the uh, both mana. I think we could have done it the other way. This only makes it close. We have black, black, green, green. Yeah, actually we could uh we casually the war next turn. Assuming Ruby lives. Assuming lives. Very unlikely, I know. We still have enough for Destiny. Destiny kind of guaranteed. No block. Need my mana. Go this one since it doesn't matter. Uh, uh, four. Artifact, no, don't want that one. Creature, enchantment, land. Uh, creature, enchant. Off double white. I want to cast Niv Mizzet in this video, that's why we're still going. Uh, we were at the 15 minute mark and I was like, uh, screw it, we'll do game 4. Because we haven't cast a Niv Mizzet and that is necessary. Call yourself Niv Mizzet.
Not my ruby. I could reanimate that. Uh, probably the right choice. Guess we could hold up this. Get a blocker. I think get another blocker. In the worst case scenario is that they play another human, tap an exile. I should have left it under there. Have and remove new visit. Block. Spot. Do a double nickname instead of a nickname drop, I think. Uh, you. Heard. tap two humans, kill me with Mizzet Reward. That's the turn. I would take that. I, I would take that. I need to get a little another turn. Sacrifice your boys to kill Nif Mizzet. Oh. Okay. Mm, I should have done it the other way then. Well, you are swimming in choices now. and draw. Neat. Resolve charm. In my life at any moment. Uh, let's... Attack. I got this one now. I think I got it. It took a long time to get here, but I think we got it in the end. Turns out playing your commander was the right choice. You just never knew. Either way, thank you guys so much for watching. Enjoy, totally like, subscribe to the channel, and I will see you next time.
Bye for now.